How to make your first comic, or any project for that matter? Well, let's start with how not to do it. Take your massive dream comic project that's 3 volumes long and 450 pages wide and try to work on it on your first day. It's like climbing a Mount Everest when you've never been on a hike before. Don't do that. I've literally done this before and have failed miserably. Trust me, it hurts. So, if you're a newbie comic creator and wanting to make your first comic, here's what has worked for me. Gather all your supplies to make your comic, like pens, pencils, sharpeners, erasers, pish, pro, stone, erase, bro, come on. Inks, a tablet of your choice, if you're old school. What you're doing right here is what we call gathering your resources and project management. Gather those things, sit down, and set up a timer for five hours and start making your comic. Wait a second, are you telling me to make my 450 page long comic in five hours? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Just, I'm just kidding. No. Make a smaller 5 to 10 page shitty version of your comic. It doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be good. It doesn't have to have the skills of a pro artist and 10 years of practice under your belt to start. Start with who you are and what you've got. Work on the comic with the intention of finishing it in the 5 hours. And increase or decrease the pace of working depending on how much time you have. Got less time? Draw faster. Lose the colors. Got more time? Draw the current panel better. Maybe a villain? Add a villain maybe? No. Yeah, fine. But when the clock stops ticking, you finish the comic. And then you will have what we call an MVP. Depending on your skill level, your MVP might be looking different and that's fine. This is my MVP. I've been drawing since I was a kid. And this is my friend's MVP. He's been drawing since like uh, yesterday. Guess what? Both are A-OK. -okay. Because what you have done here is overcome the biggest challenge any creator would struggle to complete. That is the first draft. The first draft is the first version of your project. It's bare bones, it's raw and simple, but it's complete in its own shitty way. But Keisha, why do it in five hours? Man, I don't get it. What's, the, what's with the time limit? That because, my friend, you don't get carried away by the forces of resistance, like self-doubt, research, perfectionism, overthinking, eating ice cream late at night while watching TV, and imposter syndrome. You are essentially giving yourself a disciplined deadline to create a smallest, most realist, or even honest, version of your art. Because of the time limit. You have crossed the biggest mountain 90% of the people will never get to cross, which is starting and finishing something. Okay, I know what you're probably thinking. Kesh, how do you actually make a comic? How do you draw the character? How do you panel the stuff? How do you write the story thingy? How do you do all that stuff? None of that right now isn't important. If we are truly answering the question of how to make your first comic, this is the answer. Make your first version and then make better. I have tried making comics in the past and I knew how to draw, I knew how to do all the artsy stuff, I knew how to panel, story tell and all that crap, but I didn't finish my comic. What actually helped me finish my comic was take whatever the skill that I had at that moment in time and then just sit down and then make it. And it doesn't matter what skill level you're in. If you can just draw stick figures, just, just draw stick figures and make a comic. Look at Vihan, he made one comic. That is a point. Make one with what you have at each level of your skill and know that you'll never be satisfied enough to start your dream comic project. And that is what I've come to realize and that is what I'm going to be documenting in this series of making comics where I'm going to be starting to make my own first comic book. A series of collection of these short comics such as these. So watch out for the next episode where I'm going to be talking about my project and you know, make comics and how to make them. I am scared, truly, I'll tell you that. But I want to document the, the part where I'm scared, so, and making the comic, of course. So.